circuits are in mobile phones, fridge, LEDs, MacBooks, and iPads. Alright, good morning guys. We have here an LG 49 LED TV with uh, sound and backlight working, but it has no display. So I already plugged in the device. As you can see here, uh, it's already turned on, but we're going to put in standby first and then turn it back on. So uh, it does already, you know, have the sound, the audio. But if we're going to check on the screen itself, let's try to check whether it has a display or not. And as you can see here, uh, we no long we don't have even the backlight working, so it's not lighting. So uh, what we're going to do next, we're going to check the uh, voltages first coming from the adapter to see if it has enough um, output or voltage coming from the charger itself um, going to the main board. All right. As we have uh, seen earlier, that there's a power. So there you go. We get already the 19.2 or 3 volts from the charger. So uh, that is already enough um, power to turn this TV on. Okay. That's why we get the power earlier. But uh, though we do have the power. We didn't have the, the backlight working, so we can't see any image. And also, if we're going to put like light on the screen, we still don't see anything, any sign that it has a display. Okay. So here the 12 volts is not uh, present. So we didn't have the 12 volts coming from the main board going to the uh, panel or the LVDS um, socket. Okay, so let's check the uh, other part of. So we will be replacing its main board as we advise the customer. Okay, but before that, um, we're going to check first the voltages before we're going to. Uh, put it on the LCD. Alright, so I already uh, plug this um, main board and put the switch and then let's try to check to find out whether we do have the uh, the 12 volts coming from the backlight driver IC uh, going to the um, panel. So I will be turning this on first then after, oh, we're gonna try to check the voltage now. All right, so it's turned on already. Now we're going to look for the 12 volts because on the uh, the old uh, main board we didn't have that 12 volts coming from the backlight driver. So we should have here. Okay, let's check. All right, so yeah, we have the 12 volts as you can see. And here we also have the main board um, backlight output of 19 volts. All right, so I think uh, it's good to go. We're going to install the LVDS cable as long as the speaker and the backlight. Alright, here so I was able to uh, put the LVDS cable and the speaker as long as, of course, the backlight. So, um, we need to do the same thing. Okay, we're going to try to make sure if we have the 12 volts coming from this main board, um, if it's already here with the T-con going to the panel. Okay, so let's directly test it with the T-con, with the T-con board. This is our T-con board, so we should have the 12 volts here. All right, there you go. So we get the 12 volts already. 
So uh, now we need to check whether the TCON is already working. We should have the VGH here. Okay. So VGH here is 31. Okay, 31 volts. So that's good. Let's check um, if we get already the 19 volts here. Okay, hang on. Well, when I check the back, I mean the main board, uh, the old main board, it has a different settings with or line with the backlight. That is why we didn't have the uh, the backlight working yet. So because in the old motherboard or main board, it has four lines with the backlight, two coming from the 19 volts and two from the uh, backlight driver. But for the uh, the board that we bought it only has like you know two um lines or two wires so we just need to connect uh the two lines or we just need to make the four wires we're gonna try to do it or make it like a two lines okay so that it will work all right so here's the uh, four wires of the backlight so uh two blue and two black so the two blue we're going to do it like a one blue one line and the two wires or two black wires we're gonna make it like a one black wires and connect it to the main board okay so uh, we're gonna do that later but right now we're gonna check that it's already turned on but still there's no backlight but this already image okay so I also put the antenna okay just to make sure that we get the uh, the 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 channels and as I mentioned to you earlier guys uh, this is the uh, the old main board where it has four different lines going to the backlight uh, to go into the backlight so here um, with the with this main board with the one that I got it has only two lines so we're going to I um, we're going to make the two lines the two blue lines as a one line and the same as to with uh, the black, the two black will just connect it, and uh, that is the one going to or coming from um, the backlight driver here. All right, here this is the backlight driver. So um, we just uh, the four, we just made the four wires into two wires. Okay, now let's turn it on if it will work. Okay, guys, can you see that? All right, the the backlight already turned on. Now uh, let's check on the screen if there's an image already. Okay, so let's try to check it. Check it out. All right, bingo. There you go. So uh, it's already working, guys. As you can see there. So that's it. Um, we already replaced the main board so we can actually replace uh, the backlight driver IC if we do have spare but since we don't have and we already advised the owner to replace the main board instead so um, we just ordered the main board and replace it there you go there is the input so it's all working alright so this is the channel now we can see so uh, this is how you were going to troubleshoot if your a TV or LED TV has sound and the backlight is working but it has no display on the panel or on the screen. Okay, so commonly it is something wrong with the with the backlight driver. All right, so thank you so much, guys, for uh, joining me with this video, and I'm hoping that you do also again. Um, benefit something about our video today so uh, kindly join me again on the uh, other videos uh, other video tutorial so don't forget again to share to like and of course to subscribe our channel so see you in the next videos again guys thank you